developing news here this morning is two people have now been arrested by police in Miami, Florida, just days after they robbed a jewelry store out of millions of dollars worth of jewelry in Nashville. Tony Sloan is here in studio with where things started. And Tony, now officials say, though, they're actually looking for a third person. Is that right? Yeah, that's right. And it's all hands on deck with this. Mm -hmm. A lot of different agencies coming together to try and make this arrest here. The Metro Violent Crimes Unit and robbery detectives are working with Miami Beach Police, the FBI, and BNA Police on this case. Police say the robber is made off with nearly $2 million worth of jewelry in just four minutes. Take a look at your screen here. This is the third person officers say is connected to that robbery at the Dubai Jewelry Store on Nolensville Pike last Wednesday. Police are hoping that some of you recognize him. As for the other two suspects, Miami Beach Police arrested these two on robbery charges. In that case, 34-year-old Orlando Hernandez and 38-year-old Melanie Garcia. Police say jewelry, cash, and a wig was recovered during the arrest. Now, they're accused of entering the store, one of them carrying a bouquet of flowers and pretending to browse. A third suspect followed, jammed the door, and prevented it from locking. Employees were sprayed with mace and then threatened at gunpoint. Now, Metro Police say there is a reward for any information that leads to that third suspect. If you know this person or you see them, you ask to call Crime Stoppers at 615-74-CRIME. But a very scary situation yeah, for no those. Yeah, no doubt, especially because you can tell how coordinated it is, right, Tony? I mean, so many people in on this and what they're doing to help distract so they can get away with these goods, but hopefully they track down that third person. Yeah, they're really searching. All right, we appreciate it, Tony. Thank you very much.